such a big mistake. Hi guys and welcome to today's video. Let's see if we can get Gatsby to join us as well. Hey Gatsby! Gatsby! <laughs> Gatsby's just going further and further into the hay, right? Gatsby, you really don't want to participate in this video, huh? Gatsby definitely has spent a lot of time in the hay rack already. Gatsby! <laughs> wow, Gatsby. Wow. This really did not look comfortable, you coming out of the hay rack. That deserves a treat. Of course, everyone's getting one. You go, Lulu. Fits. Sweet little T-Rex Lumi. No, I wanted to film Fitz because her feet were hanging out of the tent. It was so adorable, but Fitz woke up. Fail. Nugget is like it. It's all about the nugget. You two are very adorable pigs. Cover for their album that is about to drop. Lumi's looking extra squishy right now, but Nugget is trying to get in front of the camera so that the camera focuses on Nugget. Don't you worry, Lumi. I just put a tracking spot on you so the camera stays focused. Well, I have to tell you something because I seriously messed up. Goes to show that after owning guinea pigs for just a really long time, for years, having different herds of guinea pigs, different types of guinea pigs, different fur types of guinea pigs, different characters, different personalities, just lots of guinea pigs. I really messed up when it comes to our very poor Lumi. Nugget finally managed to get in the shot. Now the camera is focusing on Nugget. <laughs> so what has happened? You might remember that I told you that Lumi was just eating the camera. You might remember that I told you that Lumi was just spending a ton of time in her fleece Heidi's. So she was always sitting in one of these very cuddly, very comfortable Heidi's. And for real, Nugget? For real? Nugget is just doing her best to steal the show. So Lumi was always sitting in one of these very cuddly fleece items. And I didn't really think about it at this time. I just thought, well, these things are very comfortable and Lumi loves being comfortable. In general, my experience has been that the fluffier a guinea pig is, the more they enjoy lying on something very comfortable. In any case, Lumi was just spending so much time in there. You know how I kept telling you after Lumi had kind of an upset stomach that I felt like Lumi was just full of energy, just so happy to participate in everything, was the first at the gate, the first in front of the plexiglass windows. Lumi just demonstrating this, just constantly trying to interact with us, just so lively and just constantly doing stuff and really not spending that much time in her fleece hideys. Yeah, so I finally figured out the reason. So I at first thought it perhaps was because Lumi was just so happy after she got over her upset stomach that she just was really showing a new appreciation for life. Well, turns out that wasn't the case. We figured out that Lumi actually found it too cold in this room. That is the reason why she spent all of her time in her fleece items, why she didn't really want to leave them, why she didn't really want to come back for a pee flag, why she just really wanted to stay in them. She was just deeply unhappy with the temperature in this room. Now, my guinea pigs don't live in a shed. Uh, this is my living room. So it's not like it actually gets to like 
outside temperatures in winter here. We do keep the radiator on like a certain level during the night because obviously we don't want the guinea pigs to get cold and this is also our apartment where we live in so we keep the temperature at a certain level that we enjoy. But apparently Lumi just really didn't like it and it, Lumi just felt like it was too cold. Um, so my husband started closing the door during the night so that none of the heat escaped the living room during the night. And what do you know, suddenly we find Lumi outside of the fleece items all of the time just loving life, loving the guinea pig herd, loving spending time outside of her fleece items. That's where I messed up. I totally thought Lumi was just enjoying her fleece items because they are new and because they are very comfortable. Really, I would have never guessed that Lumi would be the guinea pig that is the most sensitive to colder temperatures because if you look at the guinea pig, Lumi is the, one of the most fluffiest guinea pigs that we have. None of the other guinea pigs showed any change in behavior once we started closing the door, so none of the other guinea pigs had any problems with the temperature drop in winter. But apparently Lumi just really found it too cold. It never crossed my mind that this could be the problem. So my husband found that out. I'm not even sure that I would have even arrived at this conclusion. So sorry Lumi, I wouldn't have figured that one out. That really surprised me after so many years of owning guinea pigs. You managed to really surprise me Lumi. Nugget rearranging everything. Still trying to get on camera. Nugget really has no problem with the temperature. It was really only Lumi and only during the night. So apparently she just got a little bit cold during the night. Probably because some of the heat just escaped from the living room into the rest of the apartment. Which during the night we keep a little bit cooler than during the day. And apparently Lumi didn't like that. Problem solved. We're now closing the door to the living room during the night and Lumi gets to enjoy the temperature that she's comfortable at. None of the other guinea pigs showed any sign that they didn't like something, so I honestly just would have never figured that one out. Ever since we started closing the door to the living room, Lumi's just in such a better mood. It just goes to show that after so many years of having guinea pigs, they just always surprise you. I guess Louie just likes it extra toasty, whereas everyone else is happy with the temperature as is. In any case, I'm really happy we found that out. Louie is probably very happy that spring is just around the corner. In any case, definitely a fail on my part. It just really never occurred to me that this could be a problem. Um, we've kind of kept the room at the same temperature for like the past five or six years and none of the guinea pigs ever found it like not ideal temperature wise, but this year Lumi just really doesn't like it, so problem solved. Lumi's happy, everyone's happy. I guess it's just eating the door. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and see you guys next time. Bye! Nugget, you're finally getting that shot. <laughs> you are very adorable.